Hello and welcome to my sample lesson on oaim.ie. Um, my name is Thomas Johnston and I'm from County Monaghan and today I'm going to teach you the Baltimore Salute. And because this is a sample lesson, um, I, just, I just want to give you a taste of what's to come in the rest of the module. So this is the Baltimore Salute and I play it once for you and then we'll begin to break it down and learn it together. So here goes. So now I'll play the first part again, so just listen this time again and I'll play it a little bit slower and then I'll play it phrase by phrase and we learn it together that way, so just have a listen for now. So I'll play the first phrase and you repeat after me. So after two, one, two. One more time, one, two. It. And let's try and get a little vibrato on that G. So we're going to slide from the F to the G. Let's try that just in isolation. After two, one, two. Again after two, one, two. Very good. Let's try that first phrase again with the slide into the vibrato. After two, one, two. Lovely. The next phrase. Just have a listen. Have another listen. Let's try that after two. One, two. Let's try to get a little bounce on the G or in the E, I should say. So you're taking these two fingers and doing a little, just like that. After two, one, two. One, two. So again, this is just a sample lesson. So in the other lessons, um, we will we'll look at these in more detail and maybe spend a little more time on them. So let's try those two phrases together after two. One, two. That's 
that's it. Don't forget to keep your top finger off for D to get a nice tone. And the third phrase goes like this. Just have a listen. So let's just put in a B roll in that place. Let's try that after two. Starting on A, one, two. it and three phrases together after two. One, two. Very good and the last phrase goes like this. So we're doing just have another listen. doing a G roll there and then it bounce okay G roll and it bounce and also in the other lessons we look at the rolls in more in more detail uh, for example which finger do you want to cut with what sort of effect do you want a roll to have in a tune so just have a listen again and we'll try the last phrase time one two excellent now let's try the the whole first part together and then we look at the second part all right after two one two So that's just an, another few things that we can look at in the in the other lessons so for example the 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 triplet using your tongue for that triplet let's just have a listen so it's like tick -ta, tick -ta. okay so that's the the first part, we'll play it one more time and then we'll look at the second part after two. One, two. Excellent, well done. So we look at the second part now. Okay, so I play the second part for you now and then I'll begin to break it down once again. We learn each phrase together and then we look at the part in a little more detail and try and incorporate some of those ornaments and variations and different techniques that we can use to really make the tune our own. So this is the second part. First phrase, just have a listen. After two, one, two. Let's try coming down to that high E. We try a little bounce using these two fingers. After 
after two. One, two. And in the phrase, starting on A. One, two. That's it. And the second phrase is. So we're going to try and get that nice um, tongue and triplet in there and the BCD triplet. Just have a listen. Okay, so let's try it in the phrase after two, starting on high F sharp. One, two. Let's try that again. So we're sliding from the F sharp up to the high G. One, two. That's it. And those two phrases together after two. One, two. Next phrase, sorry about the squeak there. So we're going to hop off that high B. Try that after two. One, two. Nice vibrato, maybe in that B at the end would be nice. So after two again. One, two. Lovely. And then the last phrase. Okay.